Mushrooms might be edible. No. <laughs> that was a path here. There was a path here. It's gone now. Have I been here? Okay, this is like the worst map I think I've ever seen. Oh no. Is this the Titanic? I don't, I don't know. Oh, it's this boat. It's the boat. It's a cruise ship. Alicia's nest and dream. Well, I'll be. It's the ship from Alicia's dream. How did I get here? Ah, uh, well, clearly you're still in a dream of sorts. It contains equipment for the lifeboat. A box of emergency rations and a fishing rod. Let's pick up all the things. Wait a minute. These boxes are empty. Somebody's eaten all the rations. There's only some measly crumbs left. Well, let's pick up the fishing rod as well. Close the lid. There we go. Let's uh, check out my cabin. See if it's uh, been disturbed since I last came. Oh no, this isn't my cabin. This is um, Mr. Neff's cabin. The paranoid one. It's a standard issue radio receiver. I use the mod a modified version to locate the personnel roster. This feels like a long time ago. It was. It was so long ago, Mr. Neff. Uh, it contains standard issue clothes and uniforms. So it is the exact... The exact ship before. The same dream, in fact. It's even got the, the little mouse holes. Let's use the intercom. Call engineering. Engineering department. Hello, I'm Victor Six. I'm calling from command. Now, what can we do for you? Uh, the captain just ordered um, that we stop. Affirmative. Engines at full stop, sir. Okay. Where, where are the Victors gone? Let's screw to the desktop. Um, hmm. Let's examine the bunk. This was supposed to be my bunk. It looks mildly comfortable. This bunk belonged to the bartender. I don't know why I still remember that. Let's go. Can we look through the portal? I don't think we can. Oh, we can actually. Yeah, the, the weird portal that doesn't really work properly. Alright, let's look at the mermaid. This is where I found the personnel wrestler. It served its purpose. Could you check it out again? Maybe there's more. Oh no! Oh, I remember this place. Um, let's examine the, the heater. I used to boil water from these before I met Alicia. Uh, shit. Oh, it's the same type of t shirt I sometimes wear. Okay, fine. Uh, is there anything else in here? I don't think there is. Ooh. At least it didn't break the light bulb. I mean, is there anything in here? It's still empty. Fine. Let's open the door. Uh, can we use the ink to come first? Call Bridge. Hey, Bridge. What's up? Hello? Alicia? Fine. What's going on in here? If I can take command of the ship, I might be able to steer it closer to the center of the dreamscape. That's a good point. Let's steer the ship. I can use this wheel to steer the ship, but the engine doesn't seem to be running. Well, yeah, that makes sense. I did uh, stop him from running. Uh, I can't believe I'm doing this. Oh boy. Oh no. I hope I never see this place again. What's the matter? Left a bad taste in your mouth? Who said that? I did. Your friendly bartender. 
remember me? You're still alive? Technically, no. Uh, does it really matter? Dead or alive, we're all equal down here. That's why we like it. There's no pressure, no competition. You can just be yourself, with no fear of being replaced. Say, why don't you join us? Be yourself for a while. Take a load off. It's actually pretty cozy down here. Once you get over the smell, I don't think I ever will. At least we're warm and soft. Don't be a stranger. Lie down anywhere you want. A few minutes rest will clear your mind. I'd rather not. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm siding with Neff on this. This is gross. And the fact that you're still warm is even grosser. Not fancy enough for you. Not enough stars in the guidebook. Or is the company disagreeable? Is that what you're te trying to tell us? Uh, it's not that. I have to get this rust bucket up and running again. I need to get to the center of the dreamscape. That sounds like a lot of responsibility. Did the captain send you? Have you seen her? Did she mention me? No. I'm here on my own. That's a funny way to phrase it. Uh, considering the circumstances. You think you're funny, don't you? A real comedian. No. Say. Who are you, anyway? I don't see a badge on your uniform. As a grade D violation. I was Victor Six once, but that was a long time ago. You've been reassigned since. You've been promoted to command. And now you think you're better than us? Is that what you're trying to say? No. Just because you got promoted doesn't make you better than us. Just because you still have a pelvis. What the hell? Doesn't make you the alpha male around here. Okay, let's examine the cops. Clear liquid. Ugh, gross. Uh, just because you're not missing a limb. Doesn't make you smarter than us. Um, just because your guts are still on the inside. Doesn't mean she's gonna fall for you. Okay, my guys. Can you stop being rude to me? Um... What do I need? I, I, I just need to go. I'm going. Goodbye. So we're just going to go tell engineering full steam ahead and see what problems occur after that. But let's check out the bar first. I just want to see if there's any other Victor Neffs about. No, it doesn't seem to be. Okay, fine. Let's... um. Let's go to the bar. Um, examine the dumb waiter. It's a dumb waiter. It used to send things between decks. Let's call it. Okay, we can put the dream map in there, right? No. Okay. Since there's nothing to do with it, I'm just gonna leave it for now. I'm gonna tell the engineering to go full steam ahead. Maybe we'll call the kitchen for a nice meal. Engineering department. Hello, I'm Victor Six. I'm calling from command. What can we do for you? Uh, the captain just ordered full steam ahead. That's going to be a problem, sir. Why is that? We're completely out of fuel. The ship isn't going anywhere unless we refuel. I see. Hmm. Let's ask the kitchen kitchen here. Uh, sorry, wrong number. I, I thought the kitchen might have some fuel. No? Okay. So, pretty much, what we need is some coal. And the coal is in that um, really disgusting place of terror. Down here. I don't know where, though. Just because you ain't decomposing doesn't make you the head honcho. 
Wait, we can just pick up people. You know what? I'm picking up the skeleton. And we're going to examine. Is the body of another Victor clone? Doesn't make you sexier than us. Okay, let's put it in the in the cool shoot. Grim. Um, but it's the only source of fuel I have. Okay, guess what, guys? Y'all going in the coal shoot? Rest in peace, brother. Get tricked, my guys. It's going to take a while. There we go. Look at that. That was the last of them. Hopefully that's enough fuel to take me all the way to the center. Uh, let's close the chute. Holy cow. Well, at least they're getting cremated, I guess, in, in their own way. And they're no longer insulting us. There we go. Uh, can we use the intercom? Call engineering. Engineering department. Hello, I'm Victor Six. I'm calling from command. What can we do for you? Uh, the captain just ordered full steam ahead. Affirmative. Full steam ahead. Here we go. So, where do I want to go? Obviously, to the center of the dreamscape, right? Wait, we could we could visit Selma's dream and. Um, check in on the pumpkin kingdom I mean I really enjoyed the pumpkin kingdom quest but this I mean nah nah let's let's go straight to the dreamscape I think maybe I don't know we might need to visit these people's dreams later let's go to the center if I'm reading this map correctly this heading should take me to the center of the dreamscape is that where I want to go? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that is where you want to go. The center of the dreamscape it is then. Off we go. Whee! According to the map, I'm right on top of the center of the dreamscape now. I'd better stop here for the time being. Okay, let's open the door and see what's what. Examine the rat hole. Why not? Looks like a rat hole. Yeah, I'd imagine. Um, where does one look at the view here? The deck balcony? Can we go to the deck balcony? My guy. Dude. You're not very good at walking about this place. That's for dang sure. Into the lifeboat. Disembark. Time to find out what the center of the dreamscape looks like. Yeah. Going down. Still going down. Okay. Well, this is a um, a difference. The center of the dreamscape. I finally made it. I guess I'll have to explore the rest of this place on foot. Good thing I have Mr. Martin's map. If I need to travel the dreamscape quickly, that's uh, a good hint. Um, so if I click press quick travel. I could just go to Selma's dream like that and the house okay that's cool I don't have any reason to go to those places at the moment um, but if I do I would most definitely like to check in with the, the pumpkin kingdom hey look it's another skelly boy uh, let's talk to him I guess a badly decomposed skeleton lies in the underbrush. Dry bones are all that remain of whoever this was. The skeleton's left hand is clutching a dirty scroll. Well, grab the dang scroll. Of course. 
He held on to this until the very end. I wonder why. Let's see. The scroll is waterlogged and will tear easily. But I might be able to unfurl it if I'm careful. Let's unfurl it. Careful now. There we go. Okay, what does it say? That's odd. This looks like my handwriting. But I can't recall drawing this map. Uh oh. Um, it's the scroll I found on the skeleton. It looks like a map of this place. Yeah. Mushrooms might be edible. No. <laughs> that was a path here. There was a path here. It's gone now. Odd shape. Ob shapes. I can say ob shape. Five points ob shapes. North. Maybe. Maybe. There's a lifeboat. Have I been here? Okay, this is like the worst map I think I've ever seen. I think I, I could have done it all by myself. A better map. Maybe. But then again, Victor's really bad at dreaming up maps. What kind of play? I've never seen anything like this. Sorry, I, I insta clicked. Um, look into the crib. Oh look, it's baby Neff with his little baby Neff hair. He's not changed his hairstyle since. Hello? Are you... Are you my child? Eh... Uh, no. I'm sorry to disappoint. I'm another Victor, like you. Another version of me? Something like that. There's quite a few of us down here. What can I do for you? Um, why do you look like that? Why do I look like a helpless baby? Yeah. That's a big question. Have you heard about the birth barrier? Uh, the birth barrier? According to a theory, we pass a barrier once we're born. It separates the born from the parental. Like a membrane? I think it's more to it than that, but we'll call it what you want. Um, what does that have to do with looking like a baby? The gist of it is, we're trying to reach our unborn child, right? Obviously. In order to get out there, we have to make our wishes manifest. Because this place is malleable and confirms to our whims, right? Uh, I guess. But in order to make a wish, we have to know what to wish for. We can't wish for something we've never experienced. If we could, we'd wish ourselves to this mythical unborn realm. And save our child lickety split. Makes sense. None of us can remember that far back. That's why we can't reach the birth barrier. Looks like you've got pretty close. Perhaps. It's pretty far from being prenatal, though. I took as far back as I could, but no matter how hard I try, this is as far back as I can remember. I was hoping it might trigger an even earlier memory, but so far nothing's happened. Perhaps you're missing something. Possibly. But this is the best idea I've come up with so far. I'm willing to try it out a bit longer. Besides, this crib is pretty cozy. Fair enough, I've got to go. Don't be a stranger. <laughs>